Hey there, zombie fans, it's Zombie Maker 31 and I'm here with another shop boat game, as you can tell. Now, I would play SIV game, or SIV craft, but, um, I'm telling you right now that the factions over there, CIV craft, and a few others, are just like survival games. Well, not survival games, but they're like, they're like survival missions, like you build your own town or you mine blocks, like, and that, but that would be a series for later, okay? Yeah, I, I that is something I promise, okay? But instead of that, we're gonna play SB games. Uh, it's something better, and it's actually a game. So here's the game. It's from what I've gathered, um, SB games is like a survival games or hunger games ki kind of thing but it's like more in depth and it also doesn't ha really have the cornucopia but from what I've gathered it is pretty fun and when the game starts I will uh, uh, I'll start it when Alright, I started again, and there's 10 seconds left, and there's 74 or 75 people in this game, so this is going to be interesting, I can guarantee you that. I'll be probably the... F oh yeah, see, like I said, there is no cornucopia of such things, but it's like a survival-based games. So I'm guessing that's what it's called, Sur survival-based games, actual... Oh, oh wait, no, it's actually called shop bow games, but you guys know what I mean. But either way, you have invincibility for two minutes, and, um, you, oh, explosive readings, what? I don't know. But, um, this compass shows you the nearest person to you. So, like, if there is a person 20 blocks away, and there's a person 10 blocks away, the person who's 10 blocks away will show up on your compass. Um, the person, oh, whoa, 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 uh, I what? Oh, gosh. Okay, that was weird. I think there was, like, an immense lag spike or something. Either way, let's keep going. Um, like I said, uh, you have two minutes of invincibility. This compass, uh, shows the nearest person to you. Um, I think all the maps are the same. I'm not really quite sure. But it's like this. It's like Hunger Games, but you have to survive. Like, you can chop down these wood, this wood. You have to find your own ore. It, it, it's really weird. It, it's like, it's, be, it's basically like this. It's the walls free-for-all, basically. But you have a lot less time to prepare. So, for me, what I'm going to try to do is hide in the dense jungle. Because then, uh, because of the denseness of the den jungle, it's going to be harder for me to get, um, to be found, even if they're pointing at the compass. Because let's say I go up in the trees, it'll point in a certain direction, but it won't tell me, it won't tell them exactly where. It'll tell them, uh, which way I'm at, but it doesn't say if I'm up, down, left, right, or something like that. Now, the problem with this is that it's much, there's less time to escape. So, let's say I'm underground, or like, I'm in the treetops, and, uh, I need ore, I'm going to be more vulnerable below because I won't know if someone's ab above me. So that's very dangerous. But, oh, but people aren't, but see, the, the thing about this game is that people die really fast. So you actually have to be really quick. But it, it I'm, I'm not going to lie, it is a fun game. This will be fun, I will not deny that. But, I'm, I'm going to just make a little hole in the ground and hide in here. But, um, yeah. Hope you... Why am I Steve? That's really strange. I'm not... Oh, well. Can't change that. Well, I'm supposed to be some kind of zombie scientist. Why am I Steve? Eh, I don't like that. Oh, well. Uh, let's make ourselves a pick. And lo I'll start looking for ores and such. <sighs> yeah, 
you can just tell that all these people are just like scared out of their minds because when I played the first time, I I almost died the first like the first second, just because I was uh, goofing off like I was just like walking around like the desert, and I just made like a simple like house because I didn't understand it at the time, so I just went I was just going nuts, and well, I basically died because someone found me and had a flint steel, so they burned out my house while I was in it, and they just waited outside while I burned. What they didn't know, however, is that my mine shaft was inside the house, so I was able to get a get a quick getaway. But you know, this is really really tricky. Oh, and another thing is, uh, this game has a boundary, so I'm gonna do something really special. If someone tries to follow me, they will fall like all the way down. Now, um, the whole point of this game is that you have to find, like, uh, weapons, or make weapons. Like, there'll be a few abandoned houses and temples and stuff like that, jungle temples and stuff like that. But what you can do is, uh, also mine for ores, like I'm doing right now. I hope you guys can see- oh, oh, see, here's a cavern. Here is a cavern. Oh, wait, what? Oh, you tricky cavern whole thing, you. Oh, well, well, it wasn't a cavern, but it was... It was a tricky, tricky little beast. But, oh, well. Um, as you can see in the chat, there's people who are dying from stone swords and stuff. That is going to be a very big thing, uh, because finding iron in here will be scarce really fast. So, what people are going to be most likely doing is putting up traps, or just having to go duke it out with uh, stone picks, or, I mean, uh, stone swords and bows and arrows and stuff like that. So, yeah, it's, it's going to get it really hectic really fast. See, people are already falling to their deaths. So, yeah, like I said, hectic. Really, really dang fast. Uh, just... See, I just realized a problem with this hole is that once I make this hole, I'm not going to find... I'm, there's going to be no way for me to get back up. I should probably start using my wooden pick. Oops. But what what is good about uh, when people are killing each other is that um, less... Uh, it will be less likely that there will be... There'll be uh, that they will go into the forest and just stumble upon me. Although the compass is something that they can use, of course. But since I'm in the jungle, and I'm underground, and I went underneath a tree, they will most likely think that I went up, not down. Because, you know... But, unless they're really smart, they will, uh... go down. But, if they go down... Th <laughs> this is why I'm making the hole, because... As it is deep, it will kill them automatically. Which will mean I'll be able to take their stuff and get out of here. Probably rob a few people. What? What is these explosive readings, anyways? Oh, they... Oh, okay, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, well... Well, now we know. Explosive readings are basically TNT blocks, but only they don't do any black damage. Block... Bl block damage and they just hurt people a lot like I just did to myself right there which was really stupid to me I'm actually really surprised that I haven't found any iron but why is my Y is 50 pretty sure any anything below uh, 40 is where you're gonna get a ton of iron oh oh zombies we got zombies um, another thing that's going to kill you is that, because this just keeps going, there's like no death matches, it just keeps going and going and going, is uh, mobs. Mobs will definitely try to kill you as well, which is really frightening, <laughs> because like, um, like I said, my desert temple thing, uh, it worked, but the problem was um, it burned down, so I had nothing to do, and it was also night, so I was, I was just, I... I basically died from mobs because I could not survive. 
And I also think there's special mobs, and it depends on the certain region. Like, I think, for me, for jungle biomes, uh, it will be silver, no, it will be, uh, spiders, or, I, I don't know, it, it would be, it was some kind of special mob for each biome. Oh, look, I find, I found the iron. But, um, there, each and every biome, there's a different, like, strong, I think it's probably the creeper. I, I'm not really sure, that's the problem. I know for a desert, it's a silverfish. For winter, it's a spider. Um, uh, what other biomes are there? Um, if you find like a sea-ish area, it's gonna be uh, dang, I really don't remember. Okay, either way, um, it it is it does get fun but hectic really fast. See, like, <laughs> I just want somebody to fall down here and give me food. Um. Of course, there will be no uh, like it's. This is not peaceful, as you, as we can already tell. So we're going to have to, you know, find ways uh, to get our health back. Of course, it's going to be much harder than we think. Now that I'm thinking about, it, I might actually make my house down here. I don't know how to get back up though. Ah, uh, well, at least I have my crafting bench. That is a good thing. Actually, now that I think about it, maybe I should just make this all into wood and try to make ladders. Hmm. See, I have the cobble to nerd pull up, but uh, it's just so tempting. I just don't know if I have have it all. Hmm. Should I risk it? Well, if you guys couldn't see beho before, here's my little hole of, uh, oh, oh, I just took damage. Well, that was smart of me. Okay, um, I think I'm just gonna have to nerd pull up. Like, there's nothing I, else I can think of, really, except to do that. And, um, I, I might as well make a sword. Sword. Oh. I think this is going to be the longest uh, gameplay uh, or game review since, you know, it's going to be a much harder aspect. I'm just going to have to nerd pull. I don't even have a pick. Oh my gosh, I'm an idiot. Oh no. Oh no. I can't even see, so if I... Dang it. If I screw this up, I'm going to die. Okay, come on. Okay, okay, okay. Eh, there we go. Um, I'm going to make two picks just in case. Boom, boom, boom. Two picks. All right, let's go. Um, back to the nerd pole. Do, 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 do. Um, so yeah, um, so yeah, this is going to be fun. Oh, am I, wow, really? I wonder, wow, I should really make this deeper then. Okay, I gotta be really sneaky. Gotta be sneaky. Do, 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 da. Do, da, da, da. Da, da, do. I don't have an axe, so I'm just gonna punch the wood. Okay, now hopefully uh, I won't get found out really quickly. Like somebody won't just pop up from behind me and try to kill me. But um, from what I've had experience with, is that the people who hide very well. Or the people who have teamed up with other people will survive the longest. Uh, that is what I found out from this. But, you know, the problem with teams is that once everyone's dead, you're going to have to kill each other. And to those people, and to the people who, like, feel very sad for doing that, well, you have no other choice. But, you know, 
got to do it. I think I just lost my house. Oh no, there's a zombie. Ah, die. Die, please. Please, please don't. Please, yes. Yes. Oh, I found my little uh hole. I have to find a hole. Okay. Okay. Um yeah. Yeah, let's go. Let's go with that. That'll be my little marker. Da da da. I'm I'm hoping to find some kind of like chicken just so I Oh no. Oh no, please just die zombies. Oh, there's feasts. Okay, so this they actually took a lot of things from uh, the Hunger Games. Oh no, zombies, please. Please, please no. Please, I beg of you. I I wish. Please. 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 Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, he dropped a meat. I should probably really not be eating this. No, zombie, please. Please, I beg of you. Oh, wait. Tome. Go. Oh, blow up. Why won't you blow... Uh, oh, wait. It does do block damage. Wait one second. I didn't make this. What? Oh! Oh no! Oh no! No! Well, guys, I'm sorry, but apparently a zombie has just killed me. Which is very sad. All my stuff. This is where my dead body lays. But I'm pretty sure that the person uh, made this because I did not. So, um... Whoever tried to just kill me, if you, if the person who has just tried to uh, find me and kill me, and you have failed, good job either way. If you are watching this video, good job either way. Oh yeah, um, I'm not gonna spoil the rest of this uh, game because there's a lot more to it. You know, there's still the zombies, creepers, and all that. But um, yeah. Uh, like it said, uh, there's pr a feast that, um, just like in the Hunger Games, there or the survival games, um, you know, they give like people that w what they need, like armor, like what I would probably get is food because you know I'm starving. Um, other people would get uh, armor, weapons, uh, ammo. Uh, potions. It really depends. Or m maybe even building blocks. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, it's, it's it's a fun game play thing. But this is where I'm going to leave it off. I hope you guys had a good time watching my reviews. The only thing left is Mind Z. Yes, it's a very interesting one. I'm sorry to say that all the other ones are just uh, single player games. They're not really uh, mini games but they are fun like they're just survival and stuff but they are fun the mini games in the shop though are also really fun and hopefully I can find more games to you guys liking but after this guess what I am doing mine Z that's right I am going to be a killing zombies trying to f survive the zombie hordes of everything but I hope you guys had a great time watching my video. Um, please like, subscribe, and comment below of what you liked or disliked, depending on what you liked about my videos. If you disliked it, it will help a lot. If you liked it, it still helps. Uh, I, either way, though, if you d want to or not, I hope you guys have a very zombie day, week, or month, whatever you choose. Bye, guys.